As you may already know, Season 8 has just arrived. Alongside the new region Longting and its capital Haojing are some much needed quality of life changes to crafting. Hey everyone, I'm Bear Brownies, and in today's video, I will be covering all the changes that have been made to crafting. The first thing you might notice when you log in is that your crafting materials are different. That is because steel plates and steel bars are converted into steel ingots, whilst paint and lacquer, wire and thread, and metal rings are converted into rolls of leather. This is a notable change as this makes crafting much simpler. As in most cases, you will only require powdered silver, steel ingots, and rolls of leather to craft level 30 gear. With this change also comes how many steel ingot and rolls of leather you can stack in an inventory slot. If you're like me and are a crafting addict, then this will be a welcome change as you will now have a lot of inventory space. I'm not sure what the maximum stack is, but I speculate it is 9,999, as my current biggest stack is over 8,000. Despite the changes to crafting material, there are no changes to gold dust, powdered silver, and rivets. And just like before, your ability to craft will still be limited by schematics and powdered silver. Which brings to attention that you can only receive a maximum of 6 weapon schematics this season. To clarify, you can only buy armor schematics from the seasonal store with blades. You will receive 4 weapon schematics from the battle pass at level 55, and 2 from the garrison quartermaster with 8000 fame which is extremely annoying if you are trying to craft yourself the new pike and have no schematics. Thankfully, if you do unlock the pike, you receive a free blue pike. You can now buy up to 30 powdered silver for 2,500 bronze each from the apothecary a week. You can also buy steel ingots and rolls of leather, however, you're unlikely to as you should have plenty from salvaging saddle gear anyway. The shop will reset each week in the early hours of Monday, just like your weekly quests. There are no changes to salvaging saddle gear for powdered silver, so I recommend that you continue to either salvage the shielded chamfron or iron edge saddles for powdered silver as normal. Finally, the most important change. From season 8 onwards, there is a change to attributes gained from crafted armor. You're more likely to gain multiple attributes when crafting, and it is now easier to craft equipment with crit rate, crit defense, and leadership. I personally managed to craft two pieces of armor with leadership out of a total of six crafts. Also, the ones without leadership always seem to have either crit chance or crit defense. Do note that this doesn't seem to have affected weapons, as it is not mentioned in the patch notes. However, from my extensive testing when crafting, you're most likely to craft an epic or legendary item on your first 1-2 to two crafts of an item, regardless of whether it's a piece of armor or weapon. That is why new players seem to get good crafted gear on their first couple of attempts, and despite popular belief, this is not based on player level. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to give me a thumbs up and to subscribe for more videos like this. I also stream regularly on Twitch, so make sure to check out the description for the link. Thank you for watching and have a great day.